Legs across their spectacular soy sauce The headline victory for hell high Then time for lost in the sauce Will you win a fall to defeat question Does pop star come for a free beat? We'll see We'll see, we'll see Pop star 3 beat or complete It's a really big tournament with a battle rage. With a the survivors left for dead. Oh, yeah, we'll fight to it. the end. It won't we'll be wide. Yeah, yeah. Shut up, 46. Just kidding, I love you. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to everybody all around the world, and thank you for joining us today for another Left 4 Dead 2 competitive shoutcast. My name is MK, I'll be your caster and cameraman for today, and I ain't running solo. We're here with RBT co-caster Nainal. How you doing, my friend? I am doing excellently. We're off to a great start here. Got the number one rank up against the number two rank. Only one team will survive after tonight. Yes, it is. This is the loser bracket. So if you're rooting for one of these teams, you know the loser goes home, unfortunately. Um, no, I think we are good. I think we are good. Let's see. We good. We don't need, we don't need extra slots. I can, uh, let me see. The slots. 12. All right, so we are going to be on carried off here. As for Hakori, have not seen them play at carried off yet in RBT7. Correct me if I'm wrong, chat. For Diesel, round five of Swiss, they played off against Ascendant. Got a pretty handed victory here, so they're going to be feeling pretty good. Yes, indeed. Sorry, I got a little sidetracked there trying to make sure some things are situated here on the side, but and no, I cannot. I'm sorry. I cannot cast in Spanish. Me and Naw cannot do that yet. It is, beyond ah. our, it is beyond our skills. Maybe one day it might be a possibility, but for now, we'll do our best in English for everybody. We apologize if we don't have Spanish for you, but it's going to be in English. We're going to have four chapters of Left 4 Dead 2. It is carried off. It is going to be neutral server, and look at the pings. I don't know if they just neutralize, but it is not quite even yet. But I guess it's just what they're going to roll with, dog. Look at it. Interesting. I expect them to neutralize at some point. But oh, oh, never mind, never mind. A, if, a if, you, quick... if, if you look at the net graph or just type pings in chat, it makes perfect sense. Oh, we're sense. good. Yeah, yeah, okay. we're good. I'll put the pings in chat for everybody at home so they can see how even it is. It's 160s across the board. <laughs> cool, cool. And it is pretty interesting that we see them play on neutral. Diesel has been playing home away for almost the entirety of this tournament. In fact, they played against Hikori in Swiss, home away, beating Hikori very closely by about 500 points. And be facing off again here. This time going to be neutral. Yeah, so that is actually Hikori's uh, loss from the Swiss round, if I remember correctly. It is only against them, correct? Absolutely right. Yeah, that is the only loss. And then uh, Diesel got knocked out by the underdog so far in the winner bracket. It is undecided. Uh, no, that's actually going to be tomorrow. And that's going to be Osu against Hewen for the winner bracket. No, and I'm excited for that one, too. Yeah, I don't think many people expected Osu versus Yuen to be the semifinal match. But it is going to be that tomorrow. We are here on Carried Off. Let's get into it, MK. Here we go. Four chapters of Left 4 Dead playoff tournament match starts now. Opening attack will be a Smoker Boomer, Hunter, and the Spitter. And it's going to be Hakori going first with their survivor play. Infected will be amongst, actually, by Diesel. The Hunter's going to get shut down. The Smoker gets cleared. Actually, the Hunter gets cleared. The Smoker gets pulled. The Boomer gets one at the end there and all. And that is a clean shutdown coming out from Hakori after the first hit. Yeah. Yeah, Diesel uh, went for a bit of an unorthodox hit, hitting from around the back, and it did not work out for them here, but uh, going to have another hit, and of course, on carried off, the action only ramps up, going to have insta-kill potential starting now. 
It is late tank though, 73%. They're going to spawn that hunter early. He gets caught. They're going to try something with the charger. I don't know if this charger is going to land. But the jockey gets a little bit of damage. The charger and spinner die off at the end now. So we're going to see a tri cap with boom coming up. Probably not the favorable hit that they would want on this game. Yeah, of course, can have some shenanigans with the jockey carrying off into the water. Likely not going to see that as Hakori pushes straight through. We are going to be seeing the spawn in soon. Here they are. Anna, what do you think of this attack, Nah? It's going to be a tough one, but they are just going to send it straight in. Jockey from behind, not finding anything. Hunter one-shot skeeted by Zyko. What a way to start off that hit. And they will get cleared up, only taking about a percent. Yeah, it looks like so far in all, the first three hits, only hit number two seem to do much damage of anything. They seem to shut down everything else pretty well. Um, but as far as, that'll be about, what is that? A little less than three damage per hit so far, right before the tank. But I think they get one more chance coming up here with these set of spawns. They certainly do, and it's going to be a big one here. Jockey Hunter Charger with Spitter. It looks like they may want to take the aggressive hit straight in. Uh, but of course, they can set up up on top of the Hearst Shipping Co. warehouse and wait for the survivors to break down the door. Uh, which, actually, the comments just did for us, but you know what I mean. Head through, and for the instant hit, Hunter's already spawned in here. You know what? I wouldn't be surprised if they don't send any of the spawns here. Let this tank spawn and save it for the hit to run back. Ooh. And see if they get that tank to make the jump over to this little building with the vent on it. The little graffiti building where the stairs begin. If the tank can make that jump, he can actually cut them off. So if the question is, what are they going to do here now? Go for damage or hit on the run back? Let's see what happens when they go. Take it away. They send it in. It was control with the hunter. I thought you were absolutely right there. But as you can see absolutely nothing catching except for that hunter there on the tail end it's only going to be 0.8 percent uh they spawn in the tank immediately start running it back it is going to be in the hands of control all right he looks like he's going to go for the car hit is that going to be oh my Ooh. gosh no okay it's not going to be that close but man that was a little too close for comfort for my opinion watching it from the casting chair but looks like they're going to retreat safely and they only have a two cap with a boomer right now Let's see if he brings a toy into play, and no, already if he doesn't. Yeah, it looks like they're going to line up another hit. Smoker initial connection. Charger gets wrapped around, still finds it. It is going to get cleared out, though. Boom dies as well. And one thing is the the hittable control from these top-tier tanks. Uh, control not the player, but uh, the verb, rather. And uh, it's, it's very, very uh, just a sight to see. You're going to continue to watch it unfold here. All right, he's going to bring this car into play. Rochelle's got to be, be a little... Ooh, it's kind of out of play now. I don't know if he can really make a play, but the survivors are going to retreat for safety anyways, which means he's going to get to slap it. One dangerous punch here. Can it hit anybody? No, it will not, but he can still bring it into play. Oh, my goodness, he has his tri-cap. I think he's going to roll in with this now. Why don't you take away their tank when he decides to commit this, and that hitable is now out of play. Yes, the hittable is down in the water, but he's got some more action to play with. We saw this unfold into absolute mayhem in Osu's match. Two of their players getting knocked into the water. We'll see what Diesel can do. The smoke pulled through, but he's going to run straight out of it. Got a couple cars here. 3,000 health left is all Control is going to have to play with. And he hasn't gotten anything in. Oh my god, nice attempt with the car, barely gonna miss, continuing to play around the hit of bulls, nice try with the smoker duck, and he gets wobbled on, down he goes, Zyko is down, still got two SIs, Jockey gets cleared, got a hunter smoker, picks up a rock, well, he's gonna try to kill Zyko, and Zyko is dead, still trying to get another, very close, 400 health left, attempting it once more, Hunter connects, Tries to get one more smack, won't quite get it, but Zyko is dead. Yeah, what a smoker pull and all. That was huge for his team. They managed to get a kill Shotgun. off of one of the survivors. The only thing is they're going to have three very healthy green survivors. They'll lose 70% of the DB as consequence. They still have 374 bonus. But the question is now, are they going to be able to make it? Because Grizz has to swap to their shotgun now. And they're going to have two Uzis, one shotgun for the rest of the map. And they are already sacking for a quad try.
Yeah, yeah, this is absolutely doable by, by Hokori. They still have 374 bonus, which is a very respectable amount, uh, considering they only have three players at this point, but very dangerous hits up ahead. I'm specifically thinking about when they exit Hirsch uh, Warehouse, but we'll have to wait and see. They could go for something more aggressive. Yeah, it looks like from where they're setting up, it's going to be the transition inside. I can't disagree with it. Uh, it's going to be probably one, one Oh, they're just going to send it here. This probably has the best chance of them surviving, and I think they're going to. If he could get the kill on the Hunter, Ooh. he does! They'll live, but they're going to lose a lot of points. They certainly are. That Almost jockey's going to continue to carry. Go, I think they're going to lose everything. No, not quite everything, but... Give me some help. Actually, I wonder what they're going to have when they get picked up. Remember, they had about three and change. I think it was like 320. And that'll take them down to 231. Actually, surprising that wasn't as much as I thought it was going to be in all. Yeah, they recovered from that quite gracefully. They popped one set of pills. Still got a set of pills left to go. Yaft is on a ton of permanent health. Hunter spawns in, breaks down the door, ricochets through. Double cap, spit onto Nick. But they will clear it up and keep hopping forward. Managed to pop the boomer. That's another quad sack. They need to get this distance as much as they can before the quad try. If they can hold on to any of this bonus, I think it'll it. be a win for Hikori. But I believe it's going to have to come down the survivor side for Diesel to say who will win the round now. So let's see what happens when this quad comes up and where they're going to choose to send it. What do you think? Yeah, I well, I think they send it... Uh, they can send it whenever. This is likely going to be their last, so they just want to get as much value off this as they can get. And of course, obvious analysis here, but with the quad, you can have one die or fail to get the cap and still lock it in. So it should be very doable for Diesel, but they evaded one. Let's see if they can evade this one. Jockey on the head of Nick. Charger getting ran around. Charger will get cleared as well as Jockey. It's not the quad, obviously. And uh, the spit doesn't find anything either. They hop through with 156 bonus left. Yeah, they're going to make it in with a little bit plus side of, of the 400 distance. Let's see what it totals up as a tally. They'll lose about 36 points for the distance for Zyko's death. Lose 70 DB from it. They'll still walk in with 156 plus. So they'll walk in with 520. And that's plus 120 of what just the distance alone would be. Now this is going to be a big staple on how this map, uh, this tournament match is going to lay out here. Nal, with ha however... Um, Team Diesel is going to take this tank. This is going to be such a big tank fight. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Of course, many more points left ahead, but this could be a huge breakaway moment for Diesel. We often see teams making it into the safe room with an excess of like 75% bonus sometimes. Uh, and obviously full distance as well. So we'll just have to wait and see what Diesel can do. They are headed into that 2-2 straight away. Yep, here they go. Looks like they're going to have all the infected inside except the boomer. I don't disagree with it, but they're definitely going to make sure that hunter spitter dies first for a better sack rotation. Sig's going to be front shotgun for his team, and it looks like we're going to go two shotguns, two Uzis. The other shotgun's going to be control, so Prove and Forzy are going to be the Uzi players. And here they go, coming around the corner. The hunter finds the target. They get the spit. Oh, look at the spread. He can't get out of it. Oh, what damage that comes out from that opening hit. Now over 5%. Not bad at all for a 2-2. Great start for Hokoria. Of course, keeping in mind they were still pretty much 100% after that first hit. Uh, we'll see what Hokori can scramble together here if they choose to go for something aggressive. There are two points on this bridge where, actually three, where uh, there is charge potential. So just have to wait and see. Jockey from behind, Charger from forward has already spawned in here. Jockey hopping through, gets cleared up. Hunter, Charger. Charger getting walked around. Goes for a long charge, doesn't find it. Spit, not able to. Just a brief Hunter connection. That's going to be it, MK. Yeah, very minimal there. Just really a, not an advantageous spot for Infected to get anything yeah. really whatsoever. They have no spawns down below to climb up over them. No spawns above them. Really just kind of send it all from the side of a vehicle, which lets them funnel it down. They had to send it anyways because they want to get another hit on the transition in. The sack order wasn't the greatest, though. They're going to have a poo 2 coming up here and all. I feel a boomer going in. Actually, they're just going to go. Yeah, they're just going to send this in. Spit dies for nada. Uh, Smoker will get cleared up eventually. Actually, it's a pretty cheeky boom there for a second. Smoke there for a second. Boom gets cleared up. Just found one. 92% still for Diesel as they're going to be bringing in this tank soon. But they've got a pretty big hit left to navigate. 
Yeah, definitely. One more up before tank, like you said. But if we look at the damage comparison, it's about Ready. even. It's point, yes. point zero two in favor of back Diesel. Back into our match. Still Everybody waiting for a couple spawns. Yaft is going to have to wait up the timer. <laughs> well, meanwhile, the spec HUD says they have five special infected. Now it fixes <laughs> finally. They said they had a hunter in there <laughs> with other four infected, but... Right now they have spawned. Let's see if they're going to choose to do the same and go for damage. It doesn't give them the hunter back. It gives them a tri cap with spit though. The smoker to kind of alley oop this charger before tank. Actually, now that they took .02 damage, we're at a dead even right now before Ooh. this attack here and all. And the question is, is sink is um sink is Diesel going to let one of their people die with this tank emit? Let's see what they choose to do when this tank is up. Before this tank is up, now why don't you take away the attack or whatever they choose to do with it? Okay, I think you were on to something with the last time. And they are. They're waiting for the tank to spawn in. Charge goes out, immediately gets cleared. But the spit, they have to wait. Jockey uh, kind of hiding around off to the side. Hops through. Ooh, that car was a little bit too close for comfort. But it looks like Diesel should be okay. I don't know, MK. Okay. They slow it down. They're gonna, they're gonna, they gotta take it in here now. They can't run back. Okay. They, they know it. So this is gonna be a pearly, pretty early corner for the tank. It should be almost guaranteed, depending on which way they're gonna run. If they, they can't run forward now. If they run forward, they're in such bad. They don't even. I don't even know if they realize the car is there yet. It looked like they were thinking about it. That would be such disastrous right. for them if they would choose to do so. Be like, oh crap, and find a car parking right by the door. But it looks like he's gonna have to. Wait a minute. He's gonna choose to commit from the other side. I wonder if survivors are... Oh, he's, he's in. He's in. He's committing right now. He is going to stay. Oh, nope, he's going up the stairs. He gets a punch. He eats him across. He's going to have to commit onto Rochelle now. Gets a punch at 33,000 HP. Or he gets another one. There's another one down to 2,200. There's the one more. It'll get in cap now. 1,700 HP. All the survivors are up top. They get a kill. He gets another punch here. He misses. No, he gets a punch there. Jockey lands. He gets a double. Uh -oh. He gets another punch. This is going to be a wipe if they don't clear the charger. He is down to... And it's a wipe, though. No way. Hikori is going to seal the round. And they're going to go up almost double the points. But it's going to come into play now. How big it was now that they killed Zyko with Diesel's infected round. How much is that going to come into play now that they got wiped? I gave a prediction that Diesel might be able to find a lot of points here. It was the exact opposite. They struggled to find even half the points that Hikori managed to find. Beautiful cutoff uh, using those SIs once the tank got spawned in. They didn't actually find much value except for the spitter delaying, and he certainly did his job. Jockey get, got bullied down on the back line, but they got trapped in the warehouse, and it's going to be a wipe unexpectedly. Down goes Diesel. They're going to be playing from the hole. But, MK, we got a whole lot of points left on the board. Yes, we do. Like One thing we do talk about carried off every time that you and me have casted it so far is that chapters 2, 3, and 4 are worth a boatload of points. So even right now that Zyko's t or, um, Hikori has a good upper hand, it is no way close to being over yet with these points or these maps being worth a bunch of points. It is just the beginning. Now, what we're going to have to see come into play here and all is where this tank actually is at 66% on the map. I'm trying to think where that exactly is at or it's going to be a burden to them to retreat to a safe area. I don't think so. I think this is that really scary tank uh, right outside after the event. But we'll have to wait and see. Three plus one with the boom. Smoker, Charger, Hunter. We'll see how they set up, not just for this hit, but also for the choke point up ahead because that's a very important second Reload. hit. Yes, it is, but right now they're going to have a tri-cap with Boom. They're not going to have a jockey included. They're going to rocket the charger off. Good attempt, though. The hunter gets a scratch. That's about it. Everything else is shut down clean. They'll lose just 2.1%. I believe there's a little bit of friendly fire there, unfortunately, due to the amount of bonus the other th other two survivors lost there and all. It looks like two right. and, 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 and four uh, uh, friendly fire all together. But the spawn sack order was great, and they're going to have yes. a good hit for the, the uh, gas station hit coming in. On the other side is where I think they'll send it. What do you think? 
I absolutely think so. Actually, the jockey just hops over, breaks down the door, breaks down both doors, and he repositions here. Just going to have the 2-2, but going to have the or charge spit here inside this choke point. Could definitely be lethal. That being said, we saw Osu go for a pretty unorthodox hit after they walked through this choke point. Interesting to see if Diesel takes a note out of their book. It does look like they're being allowed through the choke point for the most part. Rochelle very deep right now uh, in on the other end of the gas station here, but going to regroup with her compadres. Charger spawns in. Boom from behind. Gets instant cleared. And the spitter goes as well. Spitter just goes in. Goes for a charge stumble with the spit. I like the idea. They walk into some spit just for fun. Feeling a little bit bad for Diesel at that point. Still got that charger left alive. And he is just going to be chilling. 95% health post choke point for Akori. They are storming the gate here. Yeah, they should be able to get inside without a really advantageous hit for the infected. Looks like they're going to attempt it. They give up the... Nope, okay. They, they almost give up spawns in between. Mm. They didn't quite. I see the charger eyeing up the two cap in the back, but they don't take it. They're going to retreat, just get to a better spawn location. And just in general here and all, this is a really difficult spot to get damage with SI, in my opinion. But looks like they're going to send it. They're going to have the hunter pouncing around. They're hunting him down. He gets shut down there. Zyko says, not today. Kills the hunter, and now the other SI are kind of undecided on really what they want to do. Boomer goes in. I don't know how that does not get Coach or Ellis. How? I have no idea, Nah, but that, they're just going to hold now. <laughs> yeah, they're just going to be running through the cubicles. Another beautiful one-shot ski out of Zyko, but we've got the stairwell up ahead. Charge, smoke. They spawn in. They send it. Coach has no opportunity for reaction. He gets one smack down. He's staying in the spit. Smoker there. Oh, it's gonna, oh my god, Jockey on the head, he's gonna carry him into the side room, he still hasn't been cleared, finally gonna get knocked off the head of Yap, and I believe Yap was that one who had all of that permanent help on chapter one, and he is gonna be the one focused down, dropping up to 78.9% of the bonus, and Hakori runs back. It looks like they want to get the health. And they're doing so, but they're giving up the stairs again. The Charger looks like he wants to try to find something. They're not going to get it, but they haven't moved anywhere, Naw. No. They haven't gone nowhere, and they got to take another hit on, looks like, the P on another stairwell. Yeah. Not very good. I don't know if that was worth it, going back for the pills. Mmm. Have to wait and see here. Corey approaching. Of course, they've got the Hunter ready to go, but Charger as well. They've both given those audios. And there it is. Hunter initiating, but the charge goes in. Doesn't find anything. Coach sidesteps it. The spit is still out. Continues to rot him down. Yo, that clear from me after, after he got pounced when the Charger came was so incredible. That was such a good play coming out there from the team. Kind of make that made up from getting separated from his squad and charged yeah. it in the stairwell. But now they're out in the open, and just like you said, Nal, this is a scary tank. They're going to have to make a run back with hittables flying everywhere. <laughs> yeah, this is a very frightening tank to say the least, and they're eyeing down a quad before it. Oh my goodness, they're gonna sit in, Smoker starts the engagement, Charge not able to find anything, but it's rolling doubles, Jockey continues to be the MVP, Smoker follow up as well, ooh, they continue to drop down, another, you know, 7-8% hit, they drop down below 70%. Yes, they do, they're still holding forward though, they're about to get the tank up. I don't know where this tank is going to spawn. Is he going to spawn like right around the corner? Oh my gosh, he is right there. And they are waiting to shoot him down. They have decided to fight this here. Nope, they're going to retreat. Okay, now. Okay, they're, re they're running back. I think this is a wiser play. It's very risky. <laughs> yeah. This oh, is a wise play for sure. Oh my goodness. That was still close, no. That was still close. Yeah, it was. And I have a feeling that's not going to be the only hittable that we see uh, on this chapter that's going to be close, MK. All right, he's bringing it in. He still has a couple of SI or common infected to help him. I, this makes me think of question mark and you win, no. Back yeah. in the Swiss round when oh, just yeah. madness came out here. An interesting sink is going to choose to back off for a little bit. And maybe just chuck rock to maybe they get a better spawn rotation. I'm not quite sure now. What do you think? Uh, I, 
we got a hunter charger jockey diesel's got to be pretty happy with that of course we do see those rocks coming out and this tank isn't impossible we saw a question mark with pitch perfect execution on their side uh, but it's gonna take a herculean effort out of kakori and diesel yep he is hiding behind this he's bringing it in it Ooh. gets over but he has to go. It's not in a good spot. He's going to have to dig it out if he wants it. And he just ignores it. He has another one behind him. The Charger will miss. The Hunter's trying to find a target. He whips the punch. He gets one there. The Hunter lands, but gets cleared. The Jockey lands. He's going to get a card. No, he... Oh, no, my gosh. It's so close. He misses. And it's going to end up being a dead tank here as the car falls on the tank. Oh, my gosh. And that should be about it. That was one of the craziest tank fights I have ever witnessed, Not That was insane, but extremely well executed by Hikori, shutting down those SIs. The charge, not connecting there, was ridiculous. We still got five seconds for sync. They go and send in the boom, they don't find anything. And I don't know, MK, I feel like Diesel might be falling apart. They send in the smoke as well as the boom, they're going to be sacking. Yeah, unfortunately, the tank didn't work out in their way. So many of those hittables were so close. Now. I think we could both agree on that. And yeah. it, it can go both ways for either team. That's just the way hittables play come down to, to factor. But right now, Diesel just has to focus getting down that 777 bonus left. But right now, they're going to blitz that room, turn it off, and they might run back outside even just to clear out the commons. And that is exactly what they're going to do. It's going to be hard for a charge spit to do anything here now. They might even just hold for the inside. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it, it's going to be tough to land this hit uh, compared to somewhere like inside. And it does look like Diesel's being patient with it. Charger hopping around trying to find an ideal spot. And Hikori is taking it one step slower. They're eventually going to walk inside here. We'll see what they can do. Nice skate by Zyko once again. Charger does connect with the spit and connects with the wall as well. Nicely done. But it is once again a far cry from what they need here. Threatening a over 1300 point lock in if Diesel can't get it together. Yes, indeed. Their tank is dead. They took a hit after the event was stopped. They had 777 bonus. So that hit didn't do a, I would say, did it actually a pretty respectable amount yes. of damage come to think yes. of it. No, that's over 100 for that. And I think they'll be happy. They still have about 20% of the way the map to go through. It's a little skewed, by the way. It's more than that. There's a pull to the back missing. Hunter gets shut down. Boomer gets popped. And that will be a shutdown there. Pretty good. About, uh, about 20 damage, I think, total. No, not much more than that. Yeah, Hikori is more than happy to take that. We do see some bloodshed happen there, but not really going to be coming to play here. They do have to navigate through this inside area. Spawns coming in. Hikori taking it quick. Looks like they're setting up for a stairwell. No, they're going to continue to back it up. In goes the charge, oh. connects with the collapse. Spit comes out as well, and the hunts are blocking. Jockey finds it. This is massive for Diesel. Yap goes down. Down goes Rochelle, gets brought all the way outside, and down go two members of Akori. Wow, what did we just witness? They gotta go all the way back down there to get their teammate. They had so much bonus there. The smoker is even not going to be able to find the spawn. They'll get the pickup. But look at the bonus Ooh. drop down to 191. What an attack. Right now, they're split between them. The charger's going to take advantage of it. There goes the smoker. The charger can't find anything. And it looks like they're going to be able to regroup. But at what cost? The charger's going to go again in the exact same spot. They get someone in the pack with the smoker. The charger lands again. Oh and the charge pit is successful and yikes what happened now i you know we it, do see damage come out but i mean that was just another level out of diesel and they're continuing to bully down hikori they've got almost nothing left to speak of as they take it through the stairwell will diesel be able to take away that remaining 100 jockey on the head tries to take coach down not quite they'll continue to go through the stairs still got a hunter charger and a smoker waiting smoker drops down not able to find anything yet charger will find coach gives him a smack knocks him down 
Wow. Yeah, they're gonna, it looks like they're gonna walk in with about nothing at this point. Just some, just some pennies, quarters, and nickels. The hunter's trying to stop it. The hunter. And he gets it, but it doesn't look like it was on bonus. But they'll walk in with Dude. thirty some bonus, and they throw away about six hundred points there at the end. All that they little sure bit of did. separation, that little separation, an impressive job by Diesel taking advantage of it. We were talking about over 1,300. Now we're looking at 700. Even if Diesel gets wiped at the tank, which is a very distinct possibility, uh, they are going to be more than happy with what they just accomplished on the SI side. Now, we've got the 3-1 coming out. They immediately take it outside. We'll see how the spawns come in as far as setting up the sack order. Uh, charge, hunt, die first. Still got the smoke boom. Smoke drops in for a scratch. It's looking pretty equivalent. Yes, it is indeed. Looks like they want to try to hit in the gas station too. They won't be able to push through it all the way. If they do, they'll, it's very risky because they'll just rush into spawns. But I'm interested to see what a quarry is going to do here. No, I'll be kind of, kind of excited for this hit. I'm not going to lie. Let's see where they're going to set up at and see if it is as I think. And I, exactly lo I love want. what's happening right now. Look at the charger location. They get the stubble, Ooh. the pounce, the spit. I love it. That is exactly what they planned on. That was talked about. That was planned. I love it. That was a strategy that we talked about, and I love to see it come into play. And it gets about 9%. It is awesome to see. Now, what do you think of that? Yeah, massive hit out of the quarry. They are still staying mentally locked in after losing a whole chunk a bonus almost as much bonus as they had distance but they're not done yet they still got a lot of work left to do mk yes they do right now they're gonna have to come up with a 2-2 but it's not a bad 2-2 they have a smoker to alley-oop the charger looks like he wants to they're gonna get a pull here he gets Ooh. melted the charger's gonna miss and the free spit will get oh look at coach he's so close to not being safe in that corner and taking so much damage but that one's not gonna amount to anything now less than a percent to be exact yeah, it kind of gives a shout out to their match against NA's Last Hope, I believe, on uh, Detour Ahead, where Sink, who was that very player, got trapped up in the utility closet. But they actually sacked into the quad here for a stairwell hit. We'll see how that plays out for a court. Yes, it will indeed. Looks like the jockey's going to make a move. He's pre spawn Smoker's going to try. Here comes the Ooh. charger. Ooh, the hunter's getting one slam from the charge, two slams from the charge, scratches from the jockey. And that is amazing right there, and you'll love to see it. What damage coming out, and then the separated, separation was taken advantage of now. Yeah, that was beautifully done by Hikori. Uh, if you recall, back to Hikori's uh, survivor side, they had pretty similar troubles through here, just in different ways. Uh, and interesting to see the two different play styles of SI still finding support, or still finding success, rather. Uh, but we've got the tank coming in shortly. Gonna have one more hit here. Uh, boom, spit with the hunt charge. Charge spawns in with the door being broken down. He is waiting this out. Hunter drops down first. Into the hunt spit, charge ready to go. Beautiful follow-up, knocks him straight back down into that spit. Boom, stumbles straight through though. <laughs> XDs yeah. come out. What are we doing? Yeah, unfortunate. The boomer wanted to get a little more in there before getting the pop in there, knocking him out of the spit, but not bad damage now. Right now, if we had to compare the two as far as damage-wise before tank, I think it's it's slight favor for her quarry right now. Yes. Reloading here. By about, now, what would you say, 9% maybe, I think it was? Yes, yeah, it, it was about 69%. The hunts, jockey, it, oh, they're trying to find DP, not quite, but still able to find sync for a brief moment, and Hokori is not done in this pre-tank. Of course, they are going to be done now, as this tank is going to come in shortly, but another massive hit, bringing him down to 865 bonus pre-tank. All right, it should spawn any second. What? It, the question is, what is Diesel going to want to do here? Are they going to, it looks like they're just going to run it back to, they're going to play it safe. Tank probably wastes no time here getting this hittable in play. Let's see how well it comes into play, no, oh, and, and not going to work that well, but it's also not in a terrible position to alley-oop from here for the next shot. Oh my nice no. boom. Oh, look at that hittable, no, it's so close. But that Too boom was big. Comfort. I think he's just going to roll right in with it. Oh my yeah, god, it... they're in a bad place right now, no, they're, this is very dangerous, they're split. The tank could just keep him here, and there's nothing they could do about it. Woo! There's a jock back in the safe room area. Can the hunter oh, cover God. it? 
Oh my He's gosh. got it covered all on his own. Sink is going to be going down in one more hit. 3,000 health left on Grizz. This is a disaster to go down. Still got Nick. Rochelle gets pounced on. What are we doing here? Okay, setting up the car, <laughs> obviously. Down she goes. It's not going to matter anymore. Grizz is going to get the wipe. Beautifully done. What a triple boom to start off that engagement, MK. Ooh, what a tank coming out there. That was a questionable call on the boom. I think Diesel had kind of the right idea with the two people in the front and off, but the back two just weren't on cue with it. Yeah. So the, so the separation just caught a little disarray amongst them, it seemed. And with that jock in the back when they were separated, just there was nothing they could really do to, to regroup. And they had to focus the tank down. And I just think the boomer landing in that scenario was just nothing they could do after they were split. Yeah, the writing was really already on the wall here. And uh, that being said, this would have been a tr three times the points that Diesel found uh, would be the score line for Hikori. Uh, but because Diesel found that massive hit at the very end, they brought it down to a more, much more minor difference. That being said, they will still be down almost double that of Hikori. Yeah, but now here come the point maps. Now, even though they have a good 600-point lead, remember, it can switch at any moment. But right now, in favor for Rikori, the tank spawn being so late is probably not something that Diesel wanted to see. They're going to get at least 70% of the map points before tank. The only thing that's in their favor right now is the opening hit is good with the Smoker Jockey, Spitter, and the Charger. Yeah, we'll see how this plays out. Charge spit ready to go. Charge spawns in on the front angle. Jockey from behind. Going to try to find Rochelle, perhaps. She's pretty privy to this already. And Charger just baiting it out. Really, both sides baiting each other. It's playing a game of chicken here. We'll see who blinks first. Smoke tries to find an angle. Survivor shooting at that smoke a bit. Brings him down to 200 HP. Jockey on 37 HP. This hit is already almost done before it started. But Corey has not quite finished their food here. Still got a little bit of work left to do. Wow, they are really baiting this now. Holy this is crap. like the longest wait that we've seen. They actually wait for the anti-bait timer. And uh, the horde is going to be coming in. I don't know if they're actually going to send it here. I don't think so. I think they're just going to wait this out. Smoker dies. Jockey's still on 37 HP. They really just got a charge spit here. I don't know if I've ever seen this before, no? <laughs> I have not. I can certainly say I have not. And Proves going to probably get a Hunter now, which would be beneficial for them. No, they get a Boomer. Probably something they didn't want. They're gonna rush out here. The charger was not ready, but the jockey lands the chargers up and they wow. run through the spit and they lose 15% of their bonus. More CE oh. locking in 66 damage on his own. They are more than happy to take that. And it's like, well, you evaded it, but you stood in the spit for it. The jockey got cleared, and they had to wait through the bait for it to respawn. Uh, they do just get a boom for their troubles, find that one boom, but 15% down on Hikori straight out the safe room. Not the best start. No, the only thing good about that is none of them are slow. That's all you can really think about. But right now, they're 30% of the way through the map. They're going to have to take a very long event and all before they even get to this tank, so they have to take a lot more hits are incoming, and they do have a quad... And it looks like we're going to wait for the transition on the outside by where the death charge possibilities could be. So they're going to maximize their opportunity to make a comeback. And it's looking to me right now that that charge smoke are pretty damn hungry for the instant kill. We'll see if it comes out. They are going to be slowly pushing their way up the stairs. Of course, Corey is not a team of idiots. They know this is awaiting them, but it doesn't make it any easier for them to clear this. Oh, I love the smoker spawn. Okay, the smoker couldn't get it. If he was to say if he got that spawn, that would have been top notch right there. It's really hard to clear that pole if he's able to get it. And the charger could take him right through the opening in the gates. 
Just like we saw earlier with almost a boomer insta kill on some matches we watched before. <laughs> it was pretty tight, but it can happen, but not today. Look at that hunter coming from behind, just waiting for the opportunity. Here are they up. They have two up. They have two on the bottom. They have two. Oh, they missed the two cap. The hunter in the back is getting a lot of damage, though. Still not cleared yet. Ooh, Shockwave he loses a lot of it HP, and that is another 15% down now. I think Diesel is more than happy to take that Shockwave so close. He's on 9 HP after that. It took a long time to clear that Hunter, even for, I think that was Rochelle down there. She was dealing with demons of her own. Uh, we do have another spit ready, er, another hit ready to go. Charge Jock with the spit boom. Uh, still waiting for the initial event to end. Boom breaks down the door. Is from down below. The hit comes in. Jockey connects. Charger will not. Spit going to be evaded. And things finally starting to turn a bit for a Corey, but they're still down to 67%. Yeah, they're gonna, the only good thing for them is that they don't have to be forced to pop the pills because they're not really moving. They're stationary, so it allows them to take a hit or two without really having Shockwave not popping his pills affect the team at all. But definitely Diesel wants to try to get him down. Maybe this is also dangerous being low HP with four SI coming. That's if they can I'm get saying. him in cap and it's only 3v4. See if this comes into play. Jockey should probably spawn right, but he's in a good spot because he wants to knock down that survivor. Let's see if they can do it. I like the spawn locations. Here comes the Jockey. He chooses not to go. They land the DP. There's the end cap. The Charger just takes the pull guy. And then the Hunter actually just gets cleared, but he got the end cap. But that's really about it. Let's see what it is when they get up. But the DP's open now. That's one thing also to notice. Yeah, that hit it alone is worth over 10%. They were at 67% roundabout. And uh, the landing the try, it's going to be pretty damn deadly. They're going to continue on with 750, bringing the tank here shortly. I think they've got one more hit to deal with, though. 2-2 with the Jockey Charger yet again. We'll see what they can do. Yeah, but at this point, they had him bleeding Reloading. at this point since the end cap went out. So he had to pop pills. They do have three sets of pills. Three survivors are below 70 HP permanent, which makes it a little dangerous for a tank commit. The Charger misses, but the Jockey doesn't. This will be good damage going out onto Ellis, who is Yaft, who only has now 40 permanent HP. So it looks like this tank is going to be able to take a lot off the survivors, or at least all the pills and all after he commits. Right. And he is going to be brought in. It's going to be in the hands of Prove. Survivor is going to take it back to this wide open area around the souvenir shop. It's like he wants to get toys, but they don't want to let him get it. <laughs> understandable understandable but in the meantime smoker charger hunter is set up okay he is just gonna wrap around yeah, I, don't, I think he knows it's not worth it he'll take away too much yeah. hp it looks like he's gonna commit just just like that Thanks. yeah he certainly does he's got these survivors already so low 52, 63, 49, 40. Charger misses. Hunter finding nothing. Gets instant cleared. And he's just going to be throwing a rock and dipping out. Yeah, I don't even think he has any hittables at all. He has nothing. Survivors can be aggressive here. Try to push him back. Get a little chip. They just can't. got to be careful not to shoot the car alarm. Right. Oh, wow. They're being really aggressive for chip here. They get him down about 500. Wow, look at this chip now. This is really good chip, I would have to admit. I love the aggression coming out of Hikori, recognizing the rather dire situation they find themselves in. Prove does have to send it in. Boom, finds just one, and he heads straight down. Actually gets him two above, two below. Climbs back up, misses first hit. Two SIs have been cleared. Just got the Hunter left alive. This is still doable for Hikori. Missing a smack, getting on the Boom survivor. 300 health left, gets one more smack on Rochelle. That is going to be it. Hakori actually surviving that tank and pressing on with 400 bonus left. Yeah, pretty much all of that is DB. 85% of it to be exact. They're gonna have, they know, I don't know if there's a point in popping the pills, but he does, they'll be faster. And actually not fast at all. So they'll just go on, they'll dip under for that. They choose to set off the car alarm. There's a, a really difficult way to avoid it, but they just can't get it. And now they're gonna have everything set up on the inside with a pull in the back charger, gonna be ready to go. Smoker lands, they get the clear, the charger gets a fist. Not able to land from, oh, he gets a stumble Ooh. in the spit. 
Oh, and look at that DB cut in half, Null. And that's what we're talking about. The DB goes down so fast when it's open and halfway through with just a free spit. Yeah, I mean, considering that that was not the cleanest hit, they still lock in exactly what they needed to do. Uh, the the quad squad of Hakori dropped down, continued through, Smoker catches. The other SI is not quite ready. Now we're just going to have a Hunter Jockey Spitter. Squad of Hakori, not too fast. 15 seconds left on the spawn in from Sync, but they send it in. Hunt Spit locked in onto Nick. Able to take down the Jockey. Just going to have Sync here with five seconds left. But Hakori still got a bit of a ways to go. Just under 200 bonus left. As they go down into the parking garage, this is it. This is the last chance the Infected will get. Charger had his spawn taken from him. It is almost impossible to really land much of anything with SI here. Let's see if they can knock down the 194. Any amount of points with what they have here. Smoker is up. They have chose to hunker down here and clear out the comments. They're focusing down the smoker. They can't get him. The smoker lands. The charger is oh, successfully on hitting no. the pole. The hunter can't find anything. The boomer lands. They will get 14 points away from them with that last desperate hit there. And I'll tell you what, and all the charger really got really messed up that pole. Yeah, it, I, the charger was lost in the sauce there. 780 is going to be the scoreline for Corey, which is not bad for sure, but definitely a window of opportunity here for Diesel. But now it's going to be Diesel's side. I don't know if we're going to see as long as a bait as we did with this first attack and eventually just ending up to 15%. I don't know if we're <laughs> going to see that happen again, no, but that was one of the longest baits that I've seen, and it was a great concept and a great idea, but Diesel just capitalized on it beautifully at the last second, and Nokori got 66 damage of free spit when they all ran through it. <laughs> It was looking even scarier than that. It was very reminiscent of Dark Carney Chapter 3 on the drop-down area. Uh, the spit, they were all just standing in it. That charge, if it could have gotten the charge off and found a Kalat, uh, maybe could have even found all four of them. They just narrowly scraped by and took 15% still. So I think you're absolutely right. Not going to see that same play mirrored by Diesel, but still a very scary intro. And like we talked about at the beginning of this chapter... Uh, not the combo of SIs that you want to be eyeing down if you're the survivors here. No, they have great opportunity. I like this hit, to be honest with you and all. Sometimes I think the smoker might be better than the hunter, because depending on the situation, if you think about it, if you're pulling with the smoker from far away, you can't always necessarily get that one shot with the, with the shotgun, which gives that uh, charger just enough opportunity to get in there. It all really depends on how the survivors set up, so... I think it can go either way with the hunter or or uh, or smoker, all depending on, of course, like the map layout. You know how open it is, or how tight the corners it is. Because if you're coming around to tight corners like this, maybe you might theoretically think a hunter might be better, but that just just comes down to the raw skill of your shotgun being able to get that shot off. Well said. Well said. We are going to see the smoker jockey spawn out in pretty normal spots. Jockey going to hop around. Sync presses forward. They are taking this much more aggressively. Charger finds it. Jockey gets clear. Charge comes out. Charge spit will connect. Coach taking a little bit of spit as well. But actually, they scrape by uh, Rochelle. I don't even know if she got hit in the spit there. 96.8% the question mark comes out indeed. Yeah, they're trying to figure out that spread was absolutely awful for the special yeah. infected. I think they kind of landed correctly. It just didn't go in their favor. Yes. It's just kind of a leopard dead thing that kind of happens. But they're just gonna, they know that they did what they needed to do, so just don't stop doing what you're doing. See if you can keep getting the damage in there. You got a good amount of lead. See if you can get a hold that point delta. And then, of course, you know, Diesel wants the exact opposite to happen. And yeah. we'll see how much they want it when they have to take this interesting choke point. And they might push it because they know they don't have full spawns now. Let's see if they do that. Three seconds left on Shockwave. Up goes Diesel. The Hunter connects into the charge. No. And the spit is just going to be hopping in there for a final last-ditch effort. Not going to find anything. 94.8%. This could be it for Diesel. Oh, my goodness. I'm not quite sure exactly what happened there with the Charger, but I thought he had time to line that up. No. What do you yeah. think? Do you think he had time? Yeah, I do, too. I Yeah, they were, they were all looking at the Hunter for the time being. Charger kind of uh, pulling the trigger a little bit early. I'm right there with you. 
Um, Horn, of course, again, from our perspective, pretty easy to see. Hunter, Jockey, they both connect for a pretty brief amount of time. Boom comes up from below. And they get continue to get cut down, but it's just little slices here. Definitely not any big chops. All right, let's see. What exactly are the Infected going to want to do with this Gotta next reload. setup? Right now, they have a lot of bonus on them. If they exact, it's one, two, three, four bonus right up in the order. Hey. Exactly what they have, 93.4% to be exact. Now, let's see what spawns they got. They're going to have a tri-cap with spit. This is a good spawn rotation. Now, let's see if they can capitalize. I'm not quite sure where the charge is coming from as he's floating around in the water for me right now. But let's see where... Okay, now I see him. He's up above them. Oh, he falls off the building. Mm. Oh, they're taking a long time of getting this set up. This is a long time now to get this charger in place. Hunter's and there you go. He got around. it. He got it. He got it. Yes. He got it. They finally sent it in. The hunter's going to land. Ooh. Oh, the charger misses. Oh, it's so Unreal. unfortunate. <laughs> It still does an amazing amount of damage now, but yes. imagine if that charger landed. That would have probably been another 10%. Yeah, that would have been absolutely catastrophic for Diesel. Uh, but still a great hit out of Hikori after we were worried if they were going to find anything at all. Uh, but still over 1,000 bonus, just shy of 1,100 bonus still in the hands of Diesel. They are pre-tank, but we didn't see this tank do a ton of damage, MK. No, he didn't. He couldn't go for the hittables. Remember, if you choose to go for the hittables, now you're going to lose a couple hundred HP. Maybe even more than the couple hundred. Hunter will get skeeted. Smoker gets shut down as well as the jockey. Good job, I uh, think, there. Shutting down Yaps Hunter. And they pretty much take less than a percent from that. Maybe just from the comments that were interacting while the SI hit went in. But here is the third tank of the game for Hikori into the hands of Yaft. And the question is, now is he going to do it? Or does it look like he wants to do it either? <laughs> Yeah. He doesn't want well to take the done. chip. It, it makes sense. It makes sense. Of course, uh, shout out to Zyko for finding... Oh my god, they are going to send it in here trying to bait for the tank to find those hittables. Hunter connects, Smoker for a brief moment, and the tank drops in from behind the back, starts hitting his uh, playthings in. Only takes about 100 chip. Yeah, he's going to be able to get them in play. Ooh. Wow. Oh, those are good cars. That one might rock down on the right side of the fence. Oh, my, oh my God. gosh. No, those are so... He doesn't even need to commit from that way, but he's not going to be able to get back over. Oh, he drops it out. I didn't even know he went up there. I missed it completely. Yaft is getting his toys in play. Oh, my gosh. Woo! He clips Rochelle. This is looking disastrous for Diesel right now. There's an in-cap going out. The hunter lands, oh, and it's going to be a wide. No, what a witness. Unreal, unreal, the hittable plays coming out. The beautiful support from the SIs as well. Whereas for Diesel, those supports were looking completely stranded on kind of both the hits they tried to send in. Uh, Hokori gets it locked down. What a play. 335 and Diesel's got their work cut out for them here at the office building. Yes, they do. We are going into the final chapter. We have a thousand point delta in favor for Hikori. We're as soon as we load in, we're going to do a little um, testing on some points to see what we we got going on here. We have a chapter worth 700 distance now, and not only is it 700 distance, but it is a finale with a lot of tight corners, which is not going to bode well for Diesel at all, in my opinion. This tank is static. But no matter what, they're going to get a couple hundred points. If I remember correctly, isn't it about 500 and change that you get no matter what? Yeah. I think that's what it yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. It should it should be around that. And uh, But also, I mean, uh, Diesel is going to be very hard-pressed through here to find the points. Uh, at, like, posting. Uh, what I hope to see out of the SI play is holding on to that spit, keeping it in the rotation, and finding damage. All Hikori needs to do is chop down at Diesel. But they've got their survivor side. Uh, to start off and they have not been looking quite bulletproof on their survivor side uh the the tank wipes coming out knocking down those points of diesel uh but they have not been looking completely bulletproof and they are going to have their skills tested here through those tight corridors yes they will it does say tank at 28 percent, but we've already discussed that and all that is not true this is a static yeah. tank so 
no early bailout, but right now, let's just do a little math for the sake of it. Let's say Hikori gets to the tank and they do wipe. They'll have 2,500, about two, about 2,600 points, we'll say, would be about what they have. That'll put them right. in a 1,600 point delta. That means they'll have to walk in with 800 bonus in order to mount a comeback. It's not impossible, but it's very difficult. They know what they need to do. The question is, can they do it? Let's see. The aggression starting out from Diesel straight out the gate. Charger breaks down the door, runs back out, takes, uh, drops down to 300 health for his troubles. Survivors walking it up. Almost there. And it's going to be Nick leading the way, getting more chip onto that charge before he breaks back into the door 159 hp left on the charge and we've got zyko the one shot skeet machine going ham on this charge they're getting some wall banks he kills the charge jockey hops in and this is starting off with a bang oh my god even clears the boom first boom going back into that sack order at number two yeah zyko says not today shutting down everything in the front allowing his team to get up pretty much unscathed Yaf just looks like he took most of the damage. A little bit on the Zyko, though, so he's not scot-free. It does take a little bit for the consequence of pushing. But either way, they are up, and now they are progressing to the tank. They're coming up on about 21% of the way through the map with another stair choke coming up. No, back-to-back -back stair chokes. And Hakori is going to be approaching, approaching very gingerly. Got to clear out the SI, or the CIs. They send in the SI. Hunt, spit, connects, charge, waiting. Not quite. Double boom, and the spit lives. That's a good play. I think I agree with that, Nal. Keeping the spitter smart for this map. You need to lay the survivors in between hits and run up and get another spit. I don't disagree with it, but it looks like the survivors are trying desperately Ooh. to hunt. Oh, they get it! They catch her Yo. through the hallway. Disaster for Diesel. Yes, it is. Now they only have three infected. Are they going to go, Nal? Or are they going to wait? What do you think? They got the drop down. I, they are going to send it. Jockey gets dealt with. Smoker breaks down the door. Goes for a... Uh, they had the smoke target right in front of him, but goes for the long one. Hakori will get that quick drop down. Going to have the charge hunt here. Going to have a spit and a boom joining. Let's see how it plays out. Well, the hunter shows himself. Loses a lot of his HP now. They're waiting for that spitter to get in rotation. They got Woo! it, and they got a very chipped hunter down to 53. Charger's gonna try. Oh, he gets stuck. He doesn't find a target, and wow. neither does the charger. And they're gonna stack for a quad, but I don't know if they'll get it. Now it's gonna be close. Yeesh. Uh, you think they get it? You think they get man. it this time? I don't know. I think they do. I yeah. think they do. They've got to wrap all the way around here. They've got some time to kill. Uh, we've also got potential some potential holes in the ground as well that Diesel can attempt to play around. Uh, but as you can see, Hikori is gunning it. Rochelle hops straight over. They all do, except for Nick, who takes a long way around. Smoke, Jock, and Diesel is looking frazzled, to say the least. It looks like the quad wants to go here. They need the charger. The charger's going to have a really difficult time doing anything here. But they kind of really got to land this. The jockey's far away. He's trying to regroup with the team. It looks like they're thinking about it. Oh, my gosh. Everything is chipped, too, except the hunter. Hunter's just going to run away. Oh, my goodness. This is such an intense quad incoming here. No, I don't even know when they're going to send it. A lot hangs in the balance here, MK. They are going to attempt to send in. Charger hides back behind the door. Smoke into the charge. No, Charger once again. They're feeling unsure of themselves here. And for the third time, the SIs are getting killed before they can even approach the survivors. This is a disaster. This is a monstrous failure out of Diesel here on Chapter 4. 13, 35 points still in the hands of Akori. No hittables to play with. Just going to be dry tank with three support SIs. Once this tank gets spawned in, MK. It still hasn't spawned. I mean, they have really got yeah. so four. So 400 points looks like what the norm is. So... If they do manage to get a wipe here and all, they would only need 750, which isn't out of out of reasonable reasonable uh, possibilities of mounting a comeback. But that's if they wipe here. So this is a lot of pressure on 4Z. He must wipe with this tank, or I believe it might be for Nye, and the victory will fall for Hikori, in my opinion. I don't know if you feel the same. 
Yeah, this is looking massively Hokori favored at this moment in time. He is just going to send it in, Hunter Charger Jockey, but with all these survivors on such high HP, the, the SIs might just have to go in here pretty quick. 2,000 health left on 4ZE. Now one shot, Ski once again charges by anything. Jockey gets cleared up. Down goes Zyko, but that's going to be it and they are looking so damn healthy they're gonna pick up zyko and continue on 955 bonus left yes it is now i believe we might have we might be witnessing the exit of diesel unfortunately from rbt7 we'll have to see a little bit more let's see if they can have a possibility of mounting a quad so it's not completely out yet they're gonna kill the hunter they're going to kill what's next the smoker, there goes the boomer, and then the spitter. I do believe that was a quad sack. Now everything's gonna hang on this now too, Nal, this quad landing. Well, I will remind you, chapter two, Hikori let 600 plus bonus slip right out of their fingers at the very end. Are they going to be repeating that fate? They don't have many hits left if you're Diesel. Uh, so they are gonna have to send it here soon, but it is going to be the quad. We'll have to see if they can find a lucky, a magic, uh, I'm not gonna say lucky, uh, but a magical quad here is what it's gonna take. Yeah, and probably this is not an advantageous spot to send it either. Mm. Smoker's gonna be so difficult to find anything if everybody else is successful on top with nothing else dying in the process either. Here they're gonna go for it. They're gonna send it. The hunter goes down. Hunter finds a target. The charger would have landed too, mm -hmm. but he punches. I think that was really close to a tri cap at most there and all. Unfortunately, the smoker and the hunter had the same idea. They did. Yeah. And overlapping is going to send that quad into. The dust, 924 bonus as they head into the last stairwell. They clean it up. They're here at the top level, bringing in that helicopter. Boom, hops out, gets cleared on 2-1. Still got a charger. It's possible. It's mm. unlikely, but it is possible. Actually, what am I saying? It's probably more likely than any, any area to get in here. <laughs> oh, he rockets yeah. out, but he's not able to land. They just go for damage. And they're going to walk in with 800 bonus. Oh my goodness. This is the biggest <laughs> score I think I've ever seen on this finale. Yeah, this is just absolutely ridiculous. Over 1,500 points. And uh, if this isn't the last nail in the coffin, I don't know what is. They're going to lock it up. And that is going to be a hell of a lot of points. They Ooh. make finale no four. No, what is that? Eight hundred and change bonus. That is incredible. Eight hundred and thirty-two to be exact. That is one of the biggest bonuses I've seen. And look at Diesel with a mere one thousand and nine points to start off their foray onto the survivor side in the last round of the last chapter. Knocking on death's door is Diesel, number one rank, headed into the playoffs, taking a loss to rank eight Osu to send him down here, getting a win against Ascendant, but their run could be getting ended here quickly by Peru's last hope, Hakori. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. I mean, I mean, we could do math. Let's see if this is is the realm of possibility they, happening. Uh, they need 1855. There's only 1540 bonus here on the table. 1400. Yeah. So. Yeah, they're down what 2,500. <laughs> yeah. And seven times three is 20. Yeah, you're right. It's just not mathematically possible. So it is determined that a quarry will go one more step further and lose a bracket. And unfortunate for Diesel, they will exit, but they're going to try to put out a great in survivor side on the last chapter for their tournament. Let's see what they could do. So the response coming up is going to be a Charger, Hunter, Spitter, and Yaft is going to be a Joggy. Okay, another stairwell hit. Charger is not going to land. Going to get the stumbles. Jockey on the head, trying to bring into the spit. Respectable uh, hit, or er, respectable hold by Diesel. They continue on. 14, 16 bonus left. And MK, this was, uh, to my knowledge, the only Korean team who entered. Uh, so massive respect to Diesel carrying their 
country of South Korea all the way through here, but this will be the end of the road on Carried Off. Yeah, it will be, but they have a couple more stairwells to take. There's yeah. a one-way drop coming up. They already have spawns down waiting for them. Spitter and Hunter are kind of walking around. Smoker Boomer probably go up at the end. Make sure they ensure having that Hunter Spitter with the Charger Jockey with the next spawns coming. And who's going to be the front? It's going to be Nick. Forzy does not get the skeet. There's going to be the spit. They kill the order properly. Here comes the Smoker and Boomer dying off. Exactly the textbook stack order you want to see. And even a successful pound spit. Beautiful job by Akori now. Yeah, and I mean, Hikori, uh has just been, especially on Chapter 4, they have been incredibly locked in. Uh, Diesel has been getting dismantled by the tanks uh, that led to this situation, but Hakori er, doesn't even really need it. Of course, they've still got a lot of bonus left, but the hits have been coming through. Let's see if they can land another one. Jockey, Hunter, Charger, Spit, a lot of damage potential here. We'll see what Hakori can find when they unleash this three plus one. Interesting. Uh, I'm not quite sure. Looks like they might. They just want to. They want to guard the hole so they don't take a shortcut. Here. Oh no! They're just gonna split them. They get the stumbles in the spit. Ooh. Oh, beautiful! And wow! No, I've never seen that attack like that done before. Yeah, it was so close to holding one of the survivors as well. They barely scraped by. Bonus continues to drop down. It looks like they could actually survive the tank here. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. Could be a respectable finish out of Diesel, all things considered. Oh! <laughs> they go for it. Highly unlikely. XD. You, you, I like it. I, li I respect the effort. You gotta respect yes. it. Wait, did you see that boomer spawn? He, In, yeah. He strafe jumped from window to window. Did you see that? Nasty. Legitly, I think he jumped out of the window, strafe to that was crazy. Somebody clipped that. I I'm, I I just want to make sure I've seen that correctly. But the last tank of the game for Corey into the hand Do of Shockwave. Do it, Shockwave. Do, Do it. it. Do it. Do it. I want to see him do it. <laughs> Not an easy strafe jump too. That's a bit a pretty mm -hmm. wide one too. It's not one level. That's two levels. I'm pretty sure for them it'd be easy, but honestly, it wouldn't even matter if he missed it. <laughs> right? Yeah, that's why I think he does it. He oh! lands it, and he goes. Mk, take it away. He gets a double on his first commit. There, he gets one more. He's down to 2,800 HP. He punches Ellis yet again. Ellis yet again. He's down to 1,600 in cap at 1,200. Support's coming in. The Jockey and Hunter take the same target. They're oh. going to get the double cap. And they're going to get the clear. He gets doubles again. The GGs go out. Ooh. They're not going to wipe. They're going to survive. And there it is. The wipe goes out. No. But Corey gets the victory. 3,564. The 1,423. GG, no. What a game.